In this example, I got this uh, sample HTML file here, and it simply so far just contains an empty iframe here. If we look at it uh, through a notepad, um, like this, we can see the part here, the source, this is where we need to fill something in. We need to tell uh, it's going to use the Anywhere client, and also it's going to use a permalink to open the correct document with the correct filters. Now, let's just assume we don't know how to put in the correct syntax here. So we're going to start the other way around. We're going to go to the target line into embedded links. Here we already may have some pre -con uh, some configured links, but now we can add our own pre-configured link. So I'll just call this new pre-configured link for my document 02 link. And it's going to look up a particular document in the sales folder, the pipeline uh, dashboard, this one here. We can also add an argument here, a filter option. And this argument should be mapped to my country dimension uh, in the permalink. We can even make sure that it's called my, my country filter, like this. So having done that, I have mapped my document and my argument. Now I have a pre-configured permalink, this one here. And now we can simply go here and copy this syntax to my clipboard. You can either include the anywhere top bar or exclude it. Uh, let's just exclude the anywhere top bar. And now we go here into my HTML page and paste in the full permalink. The embed.aspx was to hide the uh, anywhere top bar. Of course, the last part here, country filter, should probably accept an argument here or a value. I'll just put in Denmark uh, manually here. Maybe that's something that should be coming from your CRM system. Uh, but let's try this one here. Save it. And then let's go to the HTML page, reload that. And it's opening up the Anywhere client. It's opening up the pipeline dashboard with Denmark as a filter.